Ultrasound scans are used for a variety of purposes during a pregnancy. Oftentimes, early in pregnancy, we use the ultrasound uh, in first trimester to assure that the fetus is viable, to check a heartbeat, um, or if a patient is unsure of when her last menstrual period occurred, then we can date the pregnancy very accurately in the first few months of pregnancy by doing an ultrasound. In the second trimester, when a patient is oh, somewhere between 16 and 22 weeks, we can very carefully assess the anatomy of the fetus, looking for anomalies. In other words, whether or not the fetus has a heart defect, a spinal defect, um, whether the brain has formed normally. It's a girl, congratulations. I've pretty much seen just overall the overview of the baby, the baby's heart, the baby's face, the gender of the baby, of course, it's a girl. Basically, she came in for an anatomy survey. And that's an exam in which we look at basically everything from head to toe. We evaluate the brain, the heart, the organs, the extremities. We look at the placenta as well as the amniotic fluid, the presentation of the baby as well. We generally um, do the anatomy survey at 18 to 22 weeks because you can visualize the heart really well at this time and you can um, easily maneuver the patient on the table and have the baby to rotate for you. As the pregnancy progresses, we use ultrasound often to determine if the fetus is growing properly. Um, additionally, we can assess fetal well-being by using ultrasound to perform a test called a biophysical profile. We see a lot of abnormalities and if they come in early enough, some things you can see in the first trimester, some, but most things we can catch in the second trimester, like doing the anatomy survey time. It gives moms options if they want to terminate the pregnancy or if they want to just you know, deal with the situation and continue with the pregnancy and just deal with the outcome.